This week in West Virginia, Governor Jim Justice celebrated the grand opening of Hino Motors' new manufacturing plant in Mineral Wells. We are so thankful and so honored in every single way. We've had so many meetings with Hino. Absolutely, we could never ever express our gratitude anymore. The governor also announced that he requested more than a million dollars for the Huntington Tri-State Airport and a pledge of one million dollars to Bluefield State College for their campus facilities. You've got part of the runway is in danger. I mean, for God's sakes, living in this airport is again the heart, the lifeblood. The Department of Veterans Assistance unveiled four new DAV transportation vans to help get veterans to and from medical appointments. The West Virginia National Guard held a deployment ceremony to honor more than 500 soldiers who are being deployed to the Middle East. And the First Lady handed out the inaugural Rhododendron Award that aims to recognize individuals in West Virginia who've demonstrated goodness and worked for the betterment of their communities. You can find more on these stories and many others in our West Virginia Week in Review newsletter.